a full <laughs> excerpt real quick from this Q post and then I'll, I'll switch it on. It's, it says, for those who think this war is fake or we are not considered a major threat, this is a direct attack by Hillary Clinton on Q and pro POTUS patriots. The article referenced has an embedded link that literally targets pro POTUS Q Twitter accounts that have been identified by Clinton deep state as serious threats, ability to shift the narrative. Twitter has already begun to remove targeted accounts, stages under false pretenses. The war is real. The threat is real. Clinton panic. Clinton fear. Judgment day coming. Q. That is it right there. That's exactly it. It's happening. It's happening. Here we go. Wait a minute, Social media with knowledge X to their avatars. The only Russians I say hell are the Silicon Valley Russians are drinking vodka martinis, serving Russian caviar. Driving fancy sports cars, smoking Cuban cigars, eating tuna tartar. It's a liberal fascist Democrats who act like Russian oligarchs. Where the mighty two hundred? James Woods, Alex Jones, it doesn't matter who you are. Laura Luma, Candace Owens, Michelle Malcolm, even Louis Farrakhan. Free speech is free speech and it's never to be trampled on. The liberal left, holy state, fascist took censorship way too far. With a mighty 200. It's like a little indoctrination with imagination. The way they turn the battle of the sexes into a gender neutral confrontation. Temptation to spare this information. And you think political was really a Russian from their affiliation. So here's my interpretation of this situation. Hillary Clinton did her very best. My father impersonation is a manifestation. Dumb and down information as we leave the balance of our future in the hands of this next generation. generation. With a mighty 200. With a mighty 200.
Yeah. Good sweet. <laughs> yeah, brother. The mighty yeah. 200 times a million. And that's what they inspired, right? Yeah. They, it's really, uh, it's a story we all, that's the story of all of us right there. You know, those 200 people represent every one of us, as far as I'm concerned. And we all have to stand up for everyone's right to speak freely. I don't care what you're saying, because they, they, they will use it against us. I mean, we have to protect free speech. Otherwise, how are we going to protect our free speech if we're take, telling them they can't speak? Let them say whatever the hell they want. And then we, uh, and we can always say, listen, we cannot let, I mean, it's obvious free speech is the most important thing in the world. And as soon as they get, uh, as soon as they shut us down, we lose. That's basically the bottom line. Either. That's why it's the First Amendment, bro. That's it. You know, you can't speak. They, they got it. The next thing is then, then it all goes down. I know the guns are most important probably, but I think freedom of speech is even more important than the guns because once you lose your right to speak, you're done. I mean, it's all. Hey, Toots, can I get a moment to say something here, brother? Of course. Who's this? This is Vexstar. This is Vexstar from Twitter. And I want to thank you because, brother, you are always giving me that endorphin high with a thumbs up from, and a heart from everything that I post. And I'm the guy that has offered you a keychain and a patch, and you just won't give me an address to send it to. This is Vexstar, uh, also known as Mr. Purple Tie here at uh, PSP. And shortly, in a I just just in a short period, I'm going to be a host on on a show here on Patriot Soapbox. But I just I had to jump in and say, Toots. Every time they play a song, I write in the chat room, Toots and I are tight. And brother, I love you. I love you. I love you, man. Oh. In a toxic masculine <laughs> kind of way, brother. Uh -huh, brother I know. <laughs> <laughs> you think I was from Philadelphia? <laughs> Hey, much love, man. That's I, I, told, I told you, I was born in Jersey, and my mom took care of Frank Sinatra's uh, father when he was in the hospital, and she used to talk to Frank in the stairwell when he was that little head behind the big microphone. Anyway, I begged, I awesome. begged to get 30 seconds with your brother, and now my life is complete. Man, <laughs> hey. <laughs> Oh, oh my lord! Hey, hey, we got we got to start a crew called the Easties, man. There's a lot of East Coasters around. I'm telling you, oh, yeah. the Eastie the Easty boy, the Easty boys. Yeah, yeah. Like, but that's it. I said Shane and Kwame to the whole show, and and the next team stuff and the satanic ritual abuse because I've had other radio shows, and, and you know we discussed the actual satanic ritual abuses of of eating and sacrificing, yada yada yada. And I sat here patiently, but when somebody mentioned free speech, I had to get my free speech in. And, and <laughs> thank you all. And uh, Salty, I think you're the one that brought me in. So I want to thank you so very much because it was nobody in pre-screening. All of a sudden, I'm sitting in uh, next in line. But anyway, hey, Toots, oh, I, I love you, man. Sassy. Yo, man, thank you sassy so much. You. It was sassy. I, I was like, no, I was like, I asked her, I said, did you bring him in? Because I, I was like, I didn't, I'm so sorry. I didn't see that you wanted to get in. So, so what did you say, Mr. Yeah. Purple Pie here and then yes. Mr. Vexstar on Twitter? Yeah. And I have a starship and it's called Starship Star Vexer. The only way you can get on it is by passing to the other side and all it is, is a comedy club, which is a respite between your now and your eternal. So you're all invited to stop by. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm his captain, Vex Star. So yeah, and this is as it gets. But let me go, just a little detail here. You know, the power of attraction, the law of attraction to where you create yes. something in your mind, like the black Cadillac in the it's driveway. The the universe. That's the secret, the secret. Yeah. See, here's the thing. I don't do it on this side because I've always had this uh, yellow custom uh, Harley chopper. But I know the day it shows up in my driveway, <laughs> it's in the yard next door to me is going to fall on me. So what I do is I create the here after. Now, just a little more detail. 1111, you know, on the clock when it says 1111, do you know what those two dots are between the 11 are called? What? It's called a colon. What happens to matter when it passes through the colon? It turns into different matter. <laughs> what I am doing, yeah, what I am doing is creating on the other side. So there is actually, and believe me, my father has many mansions, and, and one of them you know, has Amen. my name on it. I, yep. 
I just requested a starship for my friends to come along. And this, this is one of those moments that God has kept me alive just to talk to you. Every day I look for the reason I'm still alive. And today I found that moment. Toots, I love you, man. Hey, listen, I'm serious as a heart attack, brother. I want to get you my patch and my keychain. So give me a P.O. box from, you know, some guy down the <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I don't, hey, Toots, I, love it. Toots, Toots, I don't think he's a stalker, brother. He's got a stunship no. for you. Hey, yeah. <laughs> he's asleep. We got sleepwalker and we got sleep stalker. There you go, man. Yo, yo, uh, 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 when, when did, you, when did your show start? In? When did your show start? I'm just finishing up the uh, the PSP lessons with Chano, and today I did my first 20 minute presentation, which he recorded, and he's going to get it up the the line. But I don't know yet. But I, I've had three radio shows on two different networks, two shows a week. Anyway, I've I've, I've done it before, and you know I had a little ang- anxiety and apprehension about going back on the air. And then it dawns on me, all I'm going to be doing is talking to a thousand of my fellow patriots and just informing them and just talking to them. Yeah. As for He's doxing, as for doxing for someone, you can ask all of the, the show hosts. I've already sent them patches and keychains, so I won't dox you, brother. But yeah, I, I really, it really means a lot to me to get you uh, a few patches and keychains because every time I send a patch to someone, they're saying, geez, everybody wants my patch. Cool. I wish you had a picture. I would love to put it up on screen. It's, I sent him my address and it's, it's perfectly okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, well, that's all. How many hosts? All uh, Not all the hosts, but a uh, large percentage of the hosts. And, uh, even even Chano, he was the toughest. He made me send him an email first. But anyway, and it all started with Thumper. Thumper was the first one. He trusted me, gave me his business address. But anyway, that, I'm not doxing anybody. And I know I've asked you for your address a few times, but I can't blame you. Yeah, I haven't. Uh, you know who got a keychain just this morning I sent out to was Elaine May. Oh, cool. The uh, thumbs up lady. She's always screaming for people a thumbs up. Yeah, uh, I was on uh, I was online with her last night, and we you know we kept each other up till wee hours in the morning, just chatting back and forth. As I said, every day I look for the reason that God kept me alive to see that moment. And toots, this is it. So when people, so when I put in the chat room every time they play one of your songs, I'm tight with toots. Aww. Yeah, you just. I'm, I'm serious, man. The, the the endorphin. You do supply me with endorphin because I can always count on it. I really appreciate that, man. That, that's Listen, that's what it's all about. You know, that's why I write the music for people to enjoy. If you didn't enjoy it, I'd be doing something wrong, you know? So I appreciate that. Thank you. And you're, you got more energy than I got, man. You're, I think you just gave me an endorse. Did, he, did this guy come <laughs> on with a ball of fire? Like a hurricane he came with <laughs> He makes me look like I'm a little quiet boy. <laughs> hey, you got an awesome message, though, man. <laughs> I'm not trying to hog the mic. I just got to get in as many words as possible. No, dude, that's <laughs> awesome. <laughs> that was amazing. That's normally me coming in on the show. That was amazing. That was great. But I really appreciate that. That's the, I appreciate the love. It's really, it's, that's what it's all about. That's what we're all here for. And it's, we're yep. a family. We're one big family. And uh, we got to always remember that. And I say it all the time. We got to make sure we always stay united. We can't fight amongst ourselves over stupid stuff. We got to keep it together because we got a big enemy out there that's trying to take us down. And united we win, divided they win. And that's basically it. It's a very simple equation, you know? So that's uh, it's always important to do that. But great to finally get to talk to you, man. It really was. May I share my, my personal daily prayer? It's short, it's sweet. It is, I am exactly where the Father wishes me to be. I am a servant of my Lord Jesus Christ. I will not fret, for he is in my heart, and I am in his hands. Amen. 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 Thank you all. Thank you. Thank you, Sassy. Sassy and I are tight, too. <laughs> hey, listen. Thank, thank you a lot, guys. 
I'm, 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 gonna, I'm gonna bow out now and just uh, maybe go have a cup of coffee because I gotta calm down. <laughs> I, I'm gonna go. I'll walk after this. That's for sure. <laughs> I'm gonna go do a shot. Of, I'm gonna go drink a bottle of whiskey. <laughs> Hey, listen, I got well, my secret is that nicotine and caffeine are the adult Ritalin. Nicotine and caffeine are the adult Ritalin. They keep That's the Prozac. <laughs> hey, man. Do- better, better, that, better that than pills any day. That's for sure. Baxter, what's your Twitter handle? I had put it in chat. Yeah. It's at, at Star Vexer. Okay, great. Got it. S Star. Oh, yeah. F V E X E R. Oh, I'm sorry. You're right. You know why? Why I had that handle since 2007 was because that was the name of my first YouTube channel, and they struck it from me. My next channel was Froth and Blithers, and I swore that my next channel would be one pissed off M F R, but Mr. Purple Tie. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody would find you. That's for sure. <laughs> I wasn't. I wasn't going to use letters. I was going to spell it out. But anyway, yeah, I've I've had many a battle with with YouTube, and I actually got a comment yesterday. They and they said, "I can't believe you you still have a channel. You, you've been doing this for years." And I wrote back, "Yeah, I've had many a battle with YouTube to keep Mister Purple Tie. That's my YouTube channel." Anyway, I got 30,000 subscribers. I figure after tonight, I may get three more. (laughs) (laughs) I'm sorry. How many people in the room right now? Anybody could see YouTube chat? I'm just curious. Let's see here. Um, Uh, There are currently 1.2 thousand. All right, times that by like uh, another hundred. Yeah, well, currently, <laughs> yeah, currently there are more than that, but twelve twenty-two. Cool. Yep. They're all gonna go over to your Twitter account now. That's for sure. There you uh, go. Oh yeah. That would, that would be nice. Uh, yeah, uh, that I I am amazed because I changed it from Captain Vexstar to Mister Purple Tie at Star Vexer, right? And my handle here on uh, Discord is Vexstar. And every time I come on air, I have to say, no, this is Mr. Purple Tie. Mm-hmm. Anyway, Toots, I got to calm down. <laughs> hey, love you, man. Hey, Toots and I are tight. I don't know if you heard that, people, but. We did. But- <laughs> Walk it off, brother. Walk it off. <laughs> 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 my man.